Hi everybody, I am That Nursing Prof and welcome to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be discussing a mnemonic to help you remember the nursing interventions for patients who have pregnancy-related hypertensive disorders, things like gestational hypertension and preeclampsia. So let's get into it. So the mnemonic is peace, and I think that's very fitting because we want to be peaceful. We want to keep our patients relaxed. And actually that first P is for promoting bed rest, promoting rest, relaxation, having a relaxing environment, right? Low stimuli for these patients. E is to ensure good nutrition. So what happens if you have something like preeclampsia, some of those hallmark signs aside from high blood pressure are going to be things like protein in your urine and edema, so swelling, lots of swelling. So to help with those issues, we might want to increase protein in our diet and decrease sodium. A is for antihypertensive. Because we know this is a blood pressure problem, the blood pressure is too high, we need to treat that blood pressure. So antihypertensives, the most commonly used meds for um, preeclampsia and gestational hypertension are things like hydralazine and labetalol. C is to control seizures with magnesium sulfate. So if your patient does have preeclampsia and they are at risk for having a seizure, of course we want to prevent that. We don't want them to have one. So in order to do that, they might need to be started on a medication called magnesium sulfate. And then finally, E, we're going to be doing lots of monitoring, lots of evaluating, right? So of course, that blood pressure, if we start to see a pattern of it's going up, 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 that's a red flag. That's a sign we need to investigate, right? So evaluating those blood pressures, their I and O, so how much urine are they making? What's in their urine? Is it full of protein? Are they having um, issues with urinating where they're not making enough urine? What's going on? Sometimes um, when you start having algeria where you're not making enough urine, that is a sign that there's a problem with your kidneys, right? So that needs to be investigated. Respirations and deep tendon reflexes. Now these are related to that magnesium sulfate. Magnesium sulfate is a really good medication. It's very helpful, but it can also be very dangerous, okay? Sometimes it works a little too well and it can relax things just a little too much. So it can decrease the amount of respirations you're having per minute, and that can be very dangerous. Or you can have absent uh, reflexes. That means it's working a little too well, and we should probably turn it off. So peace is our mnemonic to remember our hypertensive disorders of pregnancy.